Good morning, everybody. Happy Monday. I have a festive um, shirt on today that says joy. I think it says, oh, it doesn't say joy. It says jolly. See, I'm still half asleep. Okay, because I have one that says joy. But this is the jolly. Because I'm trying to remind myself to be jolly today. Okay. There's already things going wrong at work. People are already calling me. It's about 6 o'clock. So, we're going to drive. I should arrive there about 7, 7.15. I'll work to 3.30. We'll see what happens. Might stop at the Dollar Tree. I need a couple of things. Um, yeah, so, it's going to be a fun vlog today. We have... I have some stuff already planned, so you guys will be excited. What we're going to do in this video is we're going to do the unboxing from Costway. My Christmas tree and the tree collar. The kids are excited about getting the tree up. Right, boobs? And um, we're going to get the tree up, and we're going to decorate it together. So this is something the kids and I look forward to doing every year. And that's what's going to happen. So I hope you guys enjoy the video. And I will sporadically come back and let you know what I'm doing through my day. Ooh, I'm getting in trouble by my kids because I ate chocolate cake. Sorry, Mel. Mel's mom. Sorry. I finished it. And I did not share. I'm in trouble. Okay, guys, welcome back. I am off work, and I got to get stuff done. So the boyfriend went to Target. Target, no, Walmart for me because he loves Walmart. And he picked up shower liner because we are changing this out. And I'm going to put the new hooks on for the shower curtain. So let's get started.
are here in my mess. Okay, so um, what we're gonna do is I'm gonna clean out this area because it needs to be cleaned properly. And then we're gonna talk about the tree and the collar and get it unboxed. So let's get into it. amazing i highly recommend it i'm using it magic power a dollar 25 at the dollar tree guys so definitely this is a pickup i use that to disinfect and clean so my cabinet area looks nice and clean now to be able to do the unboxing Woohoo! let's get into it all right guys now that i got everything cleaned up the boys and i are going to do this unboxing costway was so nice to make sure that we had a tree for um, Christmas for the family wanted me to do an unboxing and let me choose a tree of my choice. And to top it off, Costway has an amazing website for you guys to check out. I'll probably split the screen and show you guys some of the um, website right now as I'm talking. And they have tons of discounts and reason reasonably priced items. Tree collars, trees, blow-ups from outside. Some of the prices are just as good, if not better, than Target or Walmart that I've noticed from being from store to store. They have a lot of sales right now on their website. So I want to thank Costway so much for reaching out to me and... Asking me to do this unboxing to rate their tree, see how I like it, and to let all my subscribers know if this company is worth it or not to go buy the products. Costway, Costway, Costway was also kind enough to offer you guys a 15% discount, which is a great deal. I told them, look, I can't do an unboxing unless you guys offer something to all my beautiful people and they said yes absolutely so i'm gonna have all the product information in the description box it's gonna have the links to my tree and to my tree collar that we're gonna unbox and put up right now and it's also gonna have the 15 percent off code that costway was nice enough to give 
All right, so let's get going. Okay, guys, if I remember and I do it correctly, I will also pop up somewhere a picture of the exact tree. But if it doesn't work out on my editing or I forget to, please check the links below in the comment section and in the description box. All right, so let's get this baby open and see how it turns out. Uh-oh, Noah, I'm gonna probably need your help. Yeah. Okay. Don't cut you. Woo, I'm so excited. Christmas time is here. Okay. Let's check it. Comes it comes with lights? Yeah, oh my lord have mercy. We're not gonna be able to decorate this tree tonight. We're gonna have to save it, it, it for like day dirty, six. It looks like it's already kind of up. Um, oh, okay, so, um, okay. The instructions are right here. Um, we gotta put this on. These are the feet. Gloves, what do we need gloves for? And apparently I need gloves for the situation. So we got this. Hold this up to the camera so they can see the gloves. Wait, not that close, babe. Back up a little bit. There you go. And here are the, here are the So it does come with the full instructions. The boys are gonna help me show this to them. Okay. That must be the bottom. The stand. Oh. It comes with lights. Look, Look at this. It comes with berry picks, pine cones. And I did not get a huge tree because look at my area. I just want a beautiful small tree to fit in our space. Oh, this is gorgeous. Ethan, hold this up. Let them see the detail on that. Not too close, but yeah. Like, oh yeah, look, turn it, babe. Look at that, guys. Tell me that's not a gorgeous tree. Wow. It's so heavy. It's heavy too. Ooh, baby. Noah, you gotta hold this one. Go. Don't knock off my pine cones. Oh, look, it looks like, like the little branches are already kind of like connected somehow. Look, look, guys. It's super heavy, huh? It's heavy. Hold it, babe. But be careful. Heavy. You gotta hold it right here and in the middle and oh then God. turn it like to the side and let them see this. Don't knock the pine cones over. Okay, oh, so. Damn. We have the tree. Oh, okay, so now we gotta figure out, that must be the top. Hi, Baba, you wanna get in the box? You can't climb the tree. No, you can't, Baba. He wants to play in the box. It's okay, let him play in the box. He loves it. Okay, so now, wait, but which one's the top? This must be the this top. This one is the top. Okay, yeah. so this is the bottom. So put that one right here. Look, oh, the lights are already on it. I know, but it's got to connect somehow. Oh, here's the connection. Okay, so the the lights connect. Here's the piece. Noah, can you show everybody? Because I'm sitting down and it's hard for me to get up with my foot. Yeah, okay. You can care about the super heavy. Thank you, Costway. Hopefully you guys don't mind. My boys are helping. So it does have the connection piece. And the lights. Okay, so now give me the bottom piece. I think this is the top. Okay, so lay that down flat. Okay. It's then, not a huge tree. This? Hey, Mom, can I pop this later? Yeah. Yeah. He's addicted to popping those things. Okay, so this is the bottom. Mm, interesting. And then what about the holder? Wait, 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 wait. No, we're going to unbox that next. Yeah. How many minutes are we in? Okay, four minutes. So we're going to go ahead... And try to figure this out. We've got some little screws to put all the things in. Uh, okay, so this goes like this. Uh, point the camera down. There's Misty Girl. Misty Mama, everybody. Misty Girl, she's the... The queen bee of the house. Oh, is she going to go in the box too, mama? Sorry, it's just our crazy family. Okay, so here we have the bottom. Okay, so these must go. Oh, this is, I know what this is for. Okay, so this is the little stoppers. 
They have little stoppers on the bottom. Ethan, Noah, we're not playing with the cats. Okay. okay. Show them the black stoppers at the bottom for your uh, carpet. You see that? Okay. They can see it. I just want them to know, like, how it is, you know? Okay. So then we have to keep it like this. And then, Noah, you got to help me lift this part up. Mm -hmm. Wait. I thought... Yeah, it should go like that. Or usually... Or is this the top Wait. and this is the bottom? This might no, be... No, 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 no. Mom, if, there, this... if this was the bottom, there would have been another latch right here. Yeah. Hold on. Look, this hole right here. Goes this right. Wait, I need help, Noah. Recording. Hold it. The middle. The middle piece. Right there. Does this... Hold on. Let's look at the direction. Okay, so it says one piece, one piece, one piece. Okay. But it's a five foot tree, 1.5 meters, okay? Um, they also have six foot, six and a half feet, and seven feet, and nine feet. I got the five foot and I got the skinnier one because of our space. Um, it's supposed to come yeah, I have them. with light, extra lights. But these are what are they? I think. Look at that. Did you see extra lights in here? No. It's just misty. It, here, Maybe it's, it's in this box. Here shows the screws that go connect in here, I think. Um, changing oh. broken light. Let's just it takes this. any bulb. It's universal. Okay. So. Five foot tree. I think this piece comes off. Wait, I know those hooks go in there. Hold on. I need to figure out. Give me one second so we're not wasting more time while you guys are laughing at us. Hold on. Right. Well. Or are we supposed to put it in the screws and then put it in? No, you put it the screws in while the tree. Okay. Is in there. Ethan, you gotta screw in. <laughs> we could do this. It's a hole. Hold on. Okay. Go ahead. Put it in the hole. Why do you have the gloves on? Okay, Ethan's wearing the gloves. Give me another screw. Ethan. Is this? That's for the bottom of the tree that, that we popped up. We're going to have to save the box so we could store it. Yeah. And the so far garage. Okay. And if you guys are laughing, I hope this is entertaining for you because this is a struggle. The struggle's real. Right, here, here, <laughs> mommy, but this is part of the here, fun. Here, here, mommy. Turn it more, turn hold it, more. it. Hold it and I'll screw it in. No, no, no. Okay. Turn it. Turn it. I need to The boys. Get down, boys. He thinks he's Michael Jackson. Who? You. Oh. Since glove. Ethan has a glove, it's easier for him. And I can't twist it that much because he has gloves. Wait, I think these screws go up here. They're not down here. Why? Well, does it hold, hold, help this thing be stable? I think it's supposed to hold. Maybe. Hold it down. Well, is it stable there? Mm. Well, yeah, what is this part for? Biggest Hold on. Where's the other connector? There should be two. Oh, no, don't unravel it. Okay, this connector goes to that's this. That's marked right red. Here. Right here, right here. Right here. Goes to that one. It does it? But it doesn't. No. Wait, hold on. Wait. Okay, let's no, put right the other here, part look, of the there's, tree. There's another one. Okay, too, let's. On the other part. Yes, give me the okay. tree. Here, I got it. You have to put it on the, like, the, because it, it's like a hexagon shape. Yeah. It's hexagon? Kind of. Like this. Let me see. There. All right, now we got to fluff it out, guys. Do we unravel all this? Or no, no, just leave it. Just t Come on, Noah. 
help with the branches. We're gonna make it look really full. I have a lot of picks. Okay, pull up the um the camera, please, so they can see what we're doing. There we go. The tree is not huge, which is good. That means we could still, yeah, because we don't have a big place, guys, and we have always had a bigger tree. And I just wanted to keep it little, just for room and the cats and. All that good stuff. I think this is tied up right here. Hold on. No, you just gotta um, separate the oh, branches. No, no, no. Yeah, you're right. They're all like smushed together. All right, guys. So we're gonna go ahead and we're gonna do this. But look how pretty. Isn't it a pretty tree? Take off the gloves now, honey. So we'll do decorating tomorrow of the tree. You have to make sure the top the here is still. This is where the star goes right here, right? No, no. This, this is, is the there. top. Oh, that is? Yes, honey. Oh, I thought it was that part. We need to separate them all. And the tree is really like full. Make sure you see what I'm doing. Look, we got to do this too. They have to separate all these branches. Cause we need so we have a lot of work to do on the branches. We need space for ornaments. And I don't think I'm using a lot of ornaments this year. What I think I'm doing is um, what I think I'm going to do is... Um, I'm gonna put picks and ribbon in it because I loved the berry. You guys like the tree? Yeah. It's pretty, huh? Yeah. Well, it's looking a it little so more good. like Christmas and we have tons of fluffing to do. Do, 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 do. Okay, Ethan and Noah. Let's grab it in the middle, move it back here. Grab it from the bottom, Noah. We have a lot of fluffing to do. This is perfect for my area. Look at that. It's not too big. Oh wait, it looks like it's tilted this way. I know, it's because it's on the... Um... Oh yeah, the carpet and the other part. Hold on. Put it in the corner. What do you guys think? What do you guys think? Isn't it cute? I'm super happy with this tree. Okay, guys. We have more to do. We have to decorate it. We're saving we that to for move it basics. Back up, though. Yeah, we're going to move it back for you guys. But we're saving the decorating for Ethan's doing basics. a fantabulous job. Fantastic job, is that you mean? Yes. Fantabulous. We, you know how fluffing takes a while. I hate fluffing. I know, it's not your deal. Yeah. And I love it because now we can flourish this tree with presents. <coughs> huh? Yeah. And the beautiful pine cones I got to fix around everywhere because they're supposed to be wrapped around. All right, Ethan's going to continue. Fluffing, right? Yeah. He's so cute, my babe. <laughs> He's excited. Are you excited for Christmas? Mm -hmm. Okay. Where are the scissors at? Oh, Lord. Noah, don't get rid of the box. Where's the scissors? Can you get them? The little ones I was using? Hurry. Can you scoot it back just a little bit, babe? To the edge oh, of the carpet? I'll put it up right here so then we can get back there when we do the ornaments. Oh, okay. So, um. Well, we can put it back for now while you're. Where, the, where, where are the scissors you put, Mom? The black ones? Huh? The black ones? The black scissors? Yeah, where are they? I mean, you opened up the box. All right. We gotta find the scissors. All right. Ethan is working very hard on that tree. 
Right, babes? Yeah. He's so excited. He loves the tree, huh? Mm -hmm. It's easy for him to work with. And it's perfect for our area because we have a small place. And, I mean, I would have liked it maybe a little bit taller, but that's the one I chose. But as far as the quality, perfect. The berries, the um, um, the pine cones, and I see a pine cone that I need to fix. Um, I'm going to add picks in here, and we're going to deck this baby out. I have gorgeous picks to put in. And... Um, I have um, ribbon to put in here as well. We gotta straighten out the, um, the leaves, babe. It's very full for it being an artificial. But we're gonna fill it up with, I don't think I really want ornament ornaments on there. I think I want ribbons and picks. That's what I'm talking about this year. I love it. And that doesn't mean we won't have a real tree another year, you know, but at least I have one, you know, when money's tight and stuff. All right, I keep messing with the tree. I'm gonna let Ethan separate and then I can mess with it. All right, so let's check out this tree collar. God, I hope I picked. Ugh, the right size. I think it's done, Mom. I don't know if you want to All right. directions so you can make this tree collar for a big tree or a small tree oh man and it's why what I'm super excited <coughs> with the pouch okay see what this is so here's the tree collar in white which is what I wanted And Christmas tree collar assembly instructions. Place the four collar pieces in a circle around the base of your tree. Remove the hinge pins closed in the bag. Align the top and bottom hinges of the two collar pieces and place pin through aligned holes. Repeat step three for remaining collar pieces to complete the circle. But it I said, okay, let's bring the tree here. Is these the pieces? Yeah, those are the screws that go okay. on the side. Okay. All right, come on. Let's bring the tree here, babe. So we can figure this out. So it's one. It said in the, the thing that I could do it in a set of like two three oh yeah three i don't have to use all four so let's see this okay we, we need to train the middle babe one two yeah look it goes okay like, look when you attach it it has to go like this no look the screws have to go like that so then okay. it attaches like that and then you screw one and like that on each you're side. so smart okay come on grab it okay Let's do this, baby. Do I unplug this tree for now? Um, to put the collar around? No. Cord. Yeah, you could unplug it for now. All right. I love this tree. I'm so happy. How about you, baby? Yeah. Oh. Ooh. Okay. So... All right, so let's do this one first. Okay, and then go on that side. Can you see the pin? Where to pin it? Yeah, I know. You have to put two on each 
like thing. Okay. It's kind of hard because I can't see it. Okay, go ahead, do it here. We can fix it. So the bolt goes in like that. Okay. And then... Oh, it locks. Okay. Okay, go ahead. Oh, they made it very simple. If um a a dummy woman like me <laughs> and my eleven year old smart just, kid like, can do life. it, anybody can. Okay. It locks it. Okay, now see if we can lock it in like this with just using three. Okay, we need pins on this side. Oh. Are you holding it down? Yeah, I'm holding it. How many of those pins do we have? We have enough. Okay. It's extra. And then you gotta close that side, buddy. Can you do it? Very good. What would I do without you? As long as Noah gets to put the top on, he's not mad. Oh, yeah. <laughs> That's like his pet peeve. That's like, because he's the little man of the house. He wants to do it. There we go. Woo! Okay, let's move the tree back. Wow. Okay, guys. I used this extension cord from Aldi. I got on clearance. If you guys haven't watched me on Aldi, um, check out my clearance finds. I find a lot of great stuff. And as well as couponing for a cause, we hit different stores. So we're both able to give you full extended uh, content of different Aldi's. So that is a plus. I knew these would come in handy and I did pick up a box. I have two more left. One is going to be for the Christmas tree. So I put this in my handy dandy spot and we're going to throw that away. We're going to pick this up. And we're going to admire our Christmas tree. All right, guys. Star. I'm going to turn the camera around, take you off the tripod so you can see everything. Okay. So now I have to answer some questions. All right, guys. I hope you enjoyed this unboxing. I want to say thank you again to Costway for giving me the most amazing tree ever. I love it. It's got the berries and the pine cones. It's flocked. And it's beautiful and it's perfect because now we can flourish the house with presents and we have enough room instead of blocking our walking space to our foyer every, I mean, I had to put gifts everywhere around the house last year because our tree was too big and we didn't have enough room. And then the pine was just falling everywhere. It was horrible. So this is really going to not frustrate me this year. So that was good. All right. So I wrote down in my hand dandy book here. Um, the first question is Taylor Carson. Hi Taylor. Thank you so much for watching the channel and giving me all the love and support. I did get the snowman from Family Dollar. And um, Taylor, it says you've mentioned you're Italian. Have you visited and or have family there? Yes, I am full-blooded Italian. My grandmother and my grandfather are from a... Look at Misty. Misty girl. They're from a... Uh, 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 uh. Oh, she's in the tree collar. Oh, Lord have mercy. Okay. Um, I have family in Ponza and Sicily. I do not know them. I've never been to Italy. I would love to go. I just can't afford to go. Um, but my grandma and my grandpa told me that we have cousins and aunts and uncles there who I've never spoken to or met because my grandma only spoke to them. She spoke fluent Italian. She, uh, she also spoke fluent Spanish. My mom does not speak Italian. Um, and my grandfather did speak Italian. So yes, there is family. No, I've never been there. And no, I do not know the family that I have or if they're still alive. Because when my grandma passed away, we didn't have any contact 
And I don't even know if my mom knows how to get a hold of them, to be honest. I don't think I've ever asked. So I might put that on my bucket list of questions to ask my mom. Misty? Oh, Lord, have mercy. She is in the tree. And her little head is popping out here. Okay, next question. Thank you, Taylor, for your question. And thank you again for watching. I really appreciate it and hope you also check out all my girls, Couponing for a Cause, um, Cannon Girl, Confessions of a Dollar Tree Addict, Gina Sweppy, and simply Jessica Marie. And they'll all be pinned in the comment section and in the description box. Um, second question is from Jen Ingram. What is your day job? Okay, so my day job is I'm a medical and biller, med medical coder and biller, and my specialty is Anthem Blue Cross Blue Shield, ILWU. I deal with the Food and Workers Union, all the unions actually, all the third parties as well. Um, and my job is to transcribe medical records. I read the medical records. Um, I send medical records into the insurance companies to make sure the patient's claims are getting paid. If something doesn't get paid and it is medically necessary, I make sure to appeal that based on oh. the policies that are available. I know. I know. Go get your phone and take a picture and send it to Auntie. Oh, she's rubbing her face on Because the Auntie body. said that that was going to happen to me. So take a picture and go send it to Auntie. Okay. And then... How long have you been with the boyfriend? And this is also a question from Jen Ingram, if I'm saying your name correctly. I've been with the boyfriend, it will be in June of this year. June 1st will be our four years together and three years living together. Is Misty really so, in there? She is, she's totally in there. She's totally like... Okay, last question is Mary E. Parada. Have you lived in California your whole life? And what's my favorite place to shop? Yes, I've lived in California my whole life. I've never lived anywhere else. I was born and raised here in California. Southern California in LA County. I was born and raised. And then I moved 13 years ago to Orange County to raise my children. So I've been in Orange County longer well no since before noah was born he was thir he's 13 so 13 14 maybe 16 years now i've lived in orange county and what is my favorite place to shop okay so my favorite place to shop i would say i have two favorite places so i hope you don't mind me saying that number one i would honestly say aldi the reason for that is because Obviously, feeding my family and feeding my children are the most important. And the discounts that I can get on the food there and the special savings and it being cheaper really helps our family out a lot on um, being able to do that. And my second would be Dollar Tree because Dollar Tree can't provide the food that my family needs that would come first. Dollar Tree provides all the other goodies that we can get as well, like cleaning supplies and bread and stuff like that but i even get the bread cheaper at aldi and yeah so the, i would say my favorite place to shop which would be logically the most important would be aldi for me and the family all right guys i'm gonna go ahead and end this vlog i hope you guys enjoyed us putting <coughs> i'm so sorry enjoyed us putting together the tree Noah, can you get me water? Oh, it's here. He put it here for me already. Oh my gosh. Um, I hope that you guys enjoyed. There's Missy, everybody. She is alive and well. Someone made a comment and I didn't appreciate it, but I'm gonna let it go. Just letting you know, if you're watching, please don't say anything mean about my animals. She is perfectly fine. She has a personality of her own. I paid a lot of money to get her well again and went into my savings for it. So that was a little harsh, but I'm okay with it. <laughs> I'm gonna let it go. So she is alive and well and happy as you guys can all see. 
I don't know. I can't let people get to me. They try to. They really do. Um, I really appreciate all your love and support. And yes, both my cats are okay. I erased the comment because it was just, you know, um, not even worth talking about really. Because it just kind of rubs me the wrong way. <laughs> even though I'm still smiling. Um, I love my animals very much. And if anything happened to her, I'd do everything and spend every penny trying to take care of her that I could possibly do. Obviously, my kids come first, but they're my they're my babies too, my children. Right, baby girl? She's my baby girl. She's a pretty girl. Her eyes are doing good. The infection fully left. She has some hair loss in her back from her allergies. She had an allergy shot. She's had flea medication. I've treated my carpets. I've let the powder set. I vacuumed it up. I also cleaned my carpets and I'm gonna be cleaning my carpets again as soon as all the containers are out. I'm gonna run through my cleaner and make sure my animals are safe and we don't have a flea thing issue again. Okay. Uh, thank you, Costly, for our tree. Oh, really you do? You're happy? Okay, cool. All right, guys. Thank you guys so much for watching. I appreciate all the love and support. I love the questions. Keep them coming. Even if there are questions I might not want to answer, I'll still answer them. I don't have a problem with that, and I'll do it with a smile. So, um, check out all my girls. Don't forget about my girls. I love you guys. Thanks so much. The kids and I cannot thank you guys a much. So, Ethan, would you like to end the video? Um, like, subscribe, hit the notification bell so you never miss a video. And we will see you on the next one. Bye!